This is the Riverhawk Report, a look back, a look ahead. We watch as the seasons change. Winter becomes spring, hockey and basketball seasons become baseball, softball, and golf. There's always track and field, they just move outdoors, and so it goes. Men's basketball, the last of the winter sports playing games, closed the book on the 2010-2011 season. The Riverhawks made it to the NCAA East Regionals, but the visit was short. UMass Lowell was eliminated by the College of St. Rose, 81-68 in opening round action. The ball club played well, had a nine-point lead at the half. They could not finish. The game slipped away in the second half. It was the tail of two halves, and they won the, the more important half. We played a great first half defensively and offensively. We, we should have had more than 41 points at the half, and uh, obviously we scored 27 points in the second half. So, you know, their zone, we just couldn't get, get it going against the zone and get them out of it. That is head coach Greg Horenda. Three Riverhawks were in double digits. Akeem Williams was the game high score with 22 points. Matt Welch added 15. Romeo Diaz had 10, and we thought we take a moment to tip our hat to the basketball team that went 20 and 10 on the season. Send it back outside, picked off Williams. He'll drive the link to the floor, lay it up and in. In the paint, underneath, driving, reverse. Robbie Walton lays it in. Riverhawks with an eight point pass lead. picked off. Riverhawks the other way, Antonio Bivens left side now. Williams, three pointer, he's good. Riverhawks up, no nope. underneath, good. He's blocked by Honore. A three point shot is good by Garbaccio, Steve Walton into the forecourt, drives right side, lays it up and in. Oh, pretty move by Robbie Walton. Kicks it right side, Walton, the three-pointer is good! And it's a 10-point lead at 30 to 20. Then pass blocked by Walton, grabbed by Welch, ahead Diaz, driving, lays it up and in. Throws up, kind of a prayer, no good. Rebound, Bivens up and in. by Bromierski, drives past him, then throws left side. Three-pointer by Thompson is good! That was a terrific play by Walton. Rebound, Bivens shot, no good. Rebound, Welch up, around the rim and in. Oh, hard work under the basket. 41-29. Then left side, Hanacek blocked by Honore, a terrific play. Weldon with the rebound, met around to the forecourt, stops, holds. Cross court, left side, Bivens, watched by Bromierski, bounce pass, Honore underneath, lays it off the glass and in. Honore is both that, now it's Diaz, right elbow, Diaz drives, lays it off the glass and in. That was a really nice job by Rose. Akeem Williams drives off the glass, no good. And then Kerry Weldon jams it home. The circle, then Williams, three pointer is good. Oh, soft touch. They pull up jump, but instead decides to pass. Ball on the floor. Weldon's got it. Got it to Bivens. Stops it home. Third, Akeem Williams, left side. Welch, his jumper is good. Three-pointers. Right side pass. Picked off Riverhawks the other way. Weldon made the steal. Williams drives in the lane. Lays it off the glass and in. And he is fouled. It will count. He will go to the line. That's a fantastic play to get the river. Then to Welch, short jump left side is good. Hanifchuk does the job and then stolen from him by Williams. He'll drive back the other way, stutter step in the lane, lays it up, around the rim, it drops. Welch left side, left corner. This is Diaz, drives, lays it off the glass and in. I'm proud of him, you know, (laughs) I'm telling you, we got old freshmen. We old freshmen on the south was on the floor and we're number four seed in the east region. And we we had the game uh, in our hands and we let it go. So I think with experience, we'll come back and we'll win this. And and I'm, I'm proud of the way the team played. It wasn't like we were nervous. We came out and took it to him, but we just uh, didn't complete the job. And again, UMass Lowell Men's Basketball Riverhawks finished the season with a 20-10 and 10 record. They earned the number four seed in the NCAA East region. UMass Lowell indoor track and field season is over. Attention now will turn to the outdoor season. Four individuals and three relay teams did go to the NCAA indoor championships. None found the success they had hoped for. The outdoor season will get rolling in a couple of weeks. April 2nd, the Riverhawks will be at the Fitchburg State Gym Show. Sheehan Invitational. Baseball and softball are working hard, sweating it out under the Florida sunshine. The baseball River Hawks have been red hot. They've won their first eight in Florida. They have won 12 in a row. The softball River Hawks have been playing well as well. They split their first eight games on this Florida trip against some tough opponents. They are 7-7 seven and seven on the young season. Baseball and softball will both head back north next week. We should mention as well the UMass Lowell Golf River Hawks. They'll be in action starting on Sunday in the Southern California Intercollegiate Championship in Mission Viejo. And that's the River Hawk Report.